Malaking bagay ang naging inspirasyon sa akin ang team ng goodnewsfilipinas.com na pinangunahan ni Angie Quadra Balibay ang kanilang managing editor. Dahil po sa kanilang kakayahan at mga kwento na pinapakita nila, ako po ay nag-isip ano ba pwede kong gawin para mapalaganap ang uh, mga gandang balita sa buong mundo na makikita po natin. Kaya sa pakikipagtulungan ng Voice of America ay tayo po ay nakapag-isip uh, na magkaroon po ng tinatawag natin, Ikwento Mo Plus! DC offers you a variety of jobs in government and private sectors. But office work is not for everybody in today's economy. Your smartphone can help you earn some money and set you free. Apps will show you that new job opportunities can literally be picked up off the ground or even walked around the block. Dog walking is just one of William Nair's 12 gig jobs. All right, let's go. Washington DC native said he quit his office job several years ago. Now he uses smartphone apps to find gig jobs that give him more flexible temporary work. Presently I just make money through apps on my phone. My phone has essentially become a Swiss army knife of income. So I'm actively signed up on over a dozen different apps. And right now I make money collecting scooters and walking dogs. Nair is a part of a growing number of people contributing to what experts say is a growing gig economy. I'm incredibly flexible. That's one of the reasons I set it up this way. And it's been very liberating in terms of going from struggling at jobs where I'm you know, working full time and barely able to make ends meet. U.S. government figures say there were nearly 2 million gig workers in 2016. Hey. Don't eat wood chips. Why are you eating wood chips? Why? Get out. Get out. No. No. Nair says the apps provide all he needs for his gig job. The dog walking app even allows owners to track their pets. The start walk button, which will track your GPS. It'll give a live feed to the customer. On this day, he rakes in about $100 for his dog walking gig. And if they worked, I would ride them both at once. But then now, He's off to charge scooters. Your job is to find it, pick it up, charge it, and then get it back out on the street in a certain area before a certain time. You also, you want to ride them, honestly, and check them for any kind of damage, because it's your job to report any kind of damage to it. William can load up 30 scooters in his Prius. He collects about 20 a night and 13 during the day. That puts about $200 in his pocket. For Nair, this beats any of the office jobs he's had. I've had a number of jobs. I was in sales jobs for a number of years. I've done a handful of things. I'm starting my quest on apps. I don't need this anymore. I'm pretty sure there are better options for me, and I've found more than I can even handle. I mean, I have 12 jobs in three different states, technically, but I could go to any major city at any point and pick up work at this point. Three years after quitting his traditional office job, Nair has no regrets and plans to continue his new way of earning a living. Mikhail Komadovsky, Dmitrov Savchuk, VOA News, Washington.